Hello everyone and welcome to S3 Bubble. So in this very quick video tutorial we're going to show you how you can use the S3 Bubble DRM plugin with Elementor. Okay, so make sure you've got the Elementor page builder plugin installed and then I'm just going to do it on um, a page that I just have it set up for but you can do it on any post or page. Then if you just go to edit with Elementor. Okay, now all you have to do is simply search for the widget now if you've got the plugin installed. You can simply drag out the widget. Now just remember your video won't display in the actual preview player but it will display on your page. So you can just do all the same things that you can do with the DRM plugin um, with the block editors currently in WordPress. So just follow this tutorial first before you do anything. Okay, It's called the Secure WordPress Video Streaming Tutorial and I'll put this video in the same playlist as that tutorial. But as soon as that's done you can simply update and then if you just preview changes and then it will open a new link and then you've got your video player so you can just start playing your video so that's how easy it is to just add your video with Elementor and obviously you have the same uh, functionality to be able to add a product so you can add a product from WooCommerce so then we run a refresh it actually refreshes for you so we can see we've got our product added and then if we wanted to add like a teaser time of three seconds for them to be able to view the video before they've asked to pay and again it will update Okay, and you can click play and then after three seconds you'll see that they'll be asked to pay for the video okay so they go and they make payment with WooCommerce so it's a very quick video tutorial again make sure you go and watch this tutorial first but that's how you can use the S3 Bubble DRM plugin with Elementor